Okay, Wolfgang, welcome to Western Australia. Peter, and good nice to, to see you here in, uh, over Australia. Christmas. And welcome to Nagrom, which is where we have our graphene production cell working at the moment. I'd like to introduce you to Dave Bennett, who's been hey, running, hey, running hey, these for us. And Dave will be able to tell you the technical aspects of what's going on here and how we're producing this graphene here at Nagrom. Okay, perfect. Okay, so uh, this is the uh, graphite lump that we're sourcing out of uh, Sri Lanka. First Graphite has uh, their own mines in uh, Sri Lanka, but we also have a supplier where we're uh, bringing in material into Australia. And this is the, uh, the product that we're putting into the electrochemical cell uh, to manufacture the, the graphene. This is the electrochemical cell that we're using to convert the graphite into graphene. We have a couple of uh, baskets here which contain about 25 kilograms of the graphite lump and we're passing a direct current through the baskets. Uh, the two baskets here which have vibrators sitting on top and the uh, and we have three anodes so that we get a complete circuit going around with uh, the solution in the electrochemical cell being sulfuric acid. The baskets are, are covered in a titanium mesh and uh, that lights up with the electric charge and the exfoliated graphite, when it comes into contact with the, the mesh, further exfoliates the, uh, the graphite. The, uh, the, the sulfuric acid solution flows out of the electrochemical cell and onto uh, these screens. Here we have a 200 mesh screen, which is collecting about, uh, mostly, it's mostly graphitic material and exfoliated graphite, but there's about 16% graphene in that product there. This product will uh, eventually be sonicated, and uh, recent trials sonicating this product ends up with uh, over 90% graphene uh, once it's sonicated. The, the fluid flows through the, the first mesh, comes through the, uh, the bottom weir and onto the uh, finer mesh over here. We've got a 400 mesh screen which is collecting the finer material and we're getting about an 85 to 95 percent purity on this screen here. And again, further sonication would uh, would make that uh, even more purer. The, uh, the fluid, once it, once it, oh, come around here. The fluid comes out of the tank and passes through a small pump and then into a heat exchanger. The heat exchanger is being fed with uh, super chill or very very cold uh, chilled water and that basically uh, cools the acid solution down um, to a manageable level of around 22 degrees. As I mentioned we've got a couple of uh, vibrators on top of the uh, baskets in the electrochemical cell and that helps with moving the exfoliated graphite uh, towards the mesh. We come around here, this is our, our power source that is, uh, we've got a Xantrex power source here which is capable of supplying 600 amps and up to uh, 20 volts. The, uh, the finished material is, is vacuum dried in our station over here. So we, we first of all wash the uh, the graphitic material and graphene uh, in these vacuum flasks. Uh, by washing we, we uh, remove a lot of the sulfuric acid and the, any impurities and then that material is put into drying trays and oven dried uh, to produce the powder. Uh, after we have the powder we send that away to the University of Adelaide where it's analysed for percent purity and uh, impurities as well. So the, uh, 
the first graphite electrochemicals uh, cell, um, we estimate that it can produce uh, about five metric tonnes per, uh, per year based on our current trials. This is some of the uh, material that we have been uh, producing in um, the University of Adelaide after sonication. The, uh, we sonicate the, uh, the product and it goes from being 14% uh, graphene to over 90% graphene. And that's, that was in our first initial trials. So further, further uh, sonication will increase the uh, percent purity of the, of the um, material even further. Uh, the value of the uh, material has been estimated in commercial terms between $55,000 and $100,000 per metric tonne. So very good stuff. So uh, hopefully I've explained the uh, process that we're carrying out down here at Nagrom for first graphite. Uh, we've been working on this for the past three months on the on the trial pilot plant, and uh, it's been very successful in that short time. And so, uh, thank you, Wolfgang, for coming down. Uh, thank you very way. much, uh, Dave. Yeah, uh, Peter. Thanks, David. We don't shake hands because uh, they are dirty. I, I don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>